Hello, How To Bob here, and I wanted to share with you how I updated the front of my Ford pickup truck. You can see that I have the grill already painted black and it has the standard honeycomb behind it. While I received these bars, grill inserts, they're made out of stainless steel, and I'm going to go ahead and put those into the front of the truck here and we'll see what that looks like. So I'm going to start out by popping the hood of the truck and on the top of the grill there are four screws along the top here. I'm going to need to loosen those up and take them out all the way. Once I get those taken out, take all four of them out, set them off to the side and I'm going to get my grill inserts ready. I put the screw in and I'm going to push them in between the two bars where the mounting hole is just to hold them in place. Now on the back of the honeycomb this is what it's going to look like the screw will go through the grill the grill insert and the butterfly knot will be on the inside so i've got my bolts my screws in and i want to set this in between right here and then i can go behind the grill i don't have to take anything off the bottom and i take my butterfly nut and screw it on here you can pull the grill out just enough to get your arm in there Real easy installation on this. It's nice stainless steel. And I got it in black to match my grill. So I'll tighten that up. Get it kind of tight. Then I want to make sure there's an even gap here. And on the other side as well. And there's a screw here. Also here. And one more right here. So I'll go ahead and put those screws in using the butterfly nuts on the back. Now I want to make sure my butterfly nuts are in a vertical position. It'll hold better against the honeycomb. Once I get that one down, I'm going to go ahead down to the bottom and repeat that same process and center it up. Put the butterfly nut on the back of the honeycomb. It's kind of hard to get down to the bottom one, but it's not too bad. Next, I'm going to go with the one in the center. There's two pieces in the center because it has the emblem in the center of the grill. So I'm going to push my my screws into the grill insert grill overlay just push them in there it's real tight fit kind of hides the screws countersinks them in again i'm going to make sure that it's centered between the two spots once i get it centered where i want just take my butterfly nut and put it on from the back and make sure it's in the vertical position it holds the best that way against the honeycomb tighten it up from the front Repeat the process on the second screw. This one has two screws holding it in. Then I can move over to the right side on the center. And you can see it's filling in nicely. Got my screws already put into the grill insert. Put my butterfly nut behind it. Once I get that started here, I'll put it in the vertical position again. You can see the one just up above that that's already tightened. It's in the vertical position. so. Get that tightened up and then I'm going to do the side pieces. I've got all my bolts in the center and this one goes at a slight angle just because the grill goes backward on this, tilts back towards the car so the back of the truck. So I just have to center my grill overlay or grill insert and then put my butterfly not on the back of this. Same as I did the other one. Make sure the screws go through the center and tighten up the butterfly nuts on those as well. This is a real quick and easy upgrade for the front. Gives it a nice new look to the front of the truck. And these grill inserts or grill overlays are real nice. Stainless steel. I got them in black to match the black paint that I had painted the grill some time ago. And I've got all of them put together now and they're on the truck. I can put my four screws across the top of the grill back in and make sure I get that lined up real good. And once I get these tightened up, should be four of them across here. We'll take a look at the front of the truck and that's how you update the front of your truck. I'm How To Bob. Thanks for watching.